this is a once in a generation hospital. Just awesome to, to achieve you know, what we set out to do. In January 2009, when they got the LEAD Platinum uh, rating, it was very satisfying to know that we were able to do that. I think Dell Children's is already a model. And attaining LEAD just kind of gave one more um, notch in our belt of credibility. There are a lot of times that you can't necessarily cure an illness, but you can always heal the soul. And that's what we try to do. We try to do it with staff. We try to do it with our programs. We try to do it with, with playrooms and games. And we try to do it with the environment that we set. So while our goal is always uh, to cure as best we can, it is absolutely always to heal. And part of that's the environment that you create. When you walk around the hospital, you're always within 32 feet of a window. So you can see whether it's daytime, nighttime, raining, um, and, and it's made a big difference with, uh, you know, the healing of the kids. You see the kids looking out the windows and, and have all the daylighting and all the colored glass and, and the courtyards. It's, it's a, you know, it, it doesn't feel like hospital. The way that we have tried to incorporate the natural setting uh, here in the, in the service area. So our gardens cross the 46 counties that we serve. So you'll see cacti and you'll see pines and you'll see oaks and you'll see cedars. And uh, in spite of cedar fever, you still see cedars. So to be able to build on the beauty of Texas and not try to be someplace else. You're gonna see regional materials. Uh, we tried to get all our materials within uh, 500 miles. Um, we, we got exemplary credit for rapidly renewing materials. The stone came from a regional quarry, uh, and we can connect that with, oh, you know the building downtown, or you know, that's, that's where this stone came from. Uh, we put people to work doing that, too, because we keep, we keep jobs alive here, we keep um, the, the businesses going in the Austin area by tapping into those local resources. The technology in the building is like a Formula One race car. Everything in the building is tied to a set point, it's tied to a sensor somewhere. Uh, everything is monitored. And so everything ties back to a building energy management system. And I mean, that's what makes the building run. In order for a hospital to ensure the performance, the sustainability, you know, a good building automation system is necessary, and Siemens has fulfilled that role very nicely. So, I'm, you know, I'm, I'm happy that we have the system that, that we do and uh, wouldn't trade it for anything. Energy efficiency is the cornerstone of green, and having a top-of-the-line building automation system allows you to achieve ultimate energy efficiency. We've been able to achieve, I think, around 17% better than ASHRAE standards which was uh, our, our target for our, our lead rating. A lot of that has to do with uh, you know, the building systems. The long-term benefits of having a green building are lower operating costs for our utilities. To me, there's not a lot of difference between energy management and cost management because it's all tied together. We use the system all the time to make sure that we're optimized. Short-term benefits are in really reducing staff turnover. They love to be around the building. They love to be here. They, again, they take ownership in it. Since we've been in operation, we've been able to compare numbers back to our old hospital, and our, our number of patient days for average stay has, has started to go down. So that, that's a huge uh, benefit for the kids. It will be easier for hospitals to achieve higher levels of certification in the future just because of some of the points that we achieved and the, the manner that we achieved them. And I think it will kind of sets the high standards, the goals for other hospitals across the, the nation that they can do much better than what we've been doing. I think being happy is a part of healing. So when kids are in an environment where they can enjoy themselves and they can feel safe and secure, that's all a part of the healing process.